The last formative assignment for Related Issue 4 is a formative assignment, and it is a film exercise. And like the previous film exercises and or projects that you worked on and completed in the course, this film exercise requires you to view a film. In the case of this last film exercise, the film is The Rocket. And so you will use the film The Rocket as a context and basis for defining and illustrating 16 terms and or concepts that are listed within the assignment. This particular assignment focuses on the concepts of national identity and national unity, two of the important concepts within the fourth related issue. But you will also find a number of specific and individual concepts and terms that are also found in other specific related issues, mainly from the first related issue, that of to what extent should nation be the foundation of identity. Let's take a moment and actually go through the exercise so that you understand exactly what it is you need to do in order to complete it. Well to begin you see again that the film exercise uses the film The Rocket and that in total it is worth 48 points. This is not summative in nature however the film exercise is a formative assignment. So again, what you will need to do specifically is define each of the terms and concepts that you find listed in the film exercise and then define them and provide a visual cue, something that illustrates the meaning of the concept, be it a act or scene or event or character that visually illustrates the meaning of the term and or concept. Along with doing this, you will also need to make sure that the visual cue that you provide is fully explained. In other, other words, you will need to ensure that your film illustration includes an explanation of exactly how the visual cue that you have selected illustrates the meaning of the term and or concept. Let's take a moment now and go through the actual terms and concepts that you will have to define and visually illustrate. Well here are the first five. The first two, identity and nation, you'll find were concepts in the first related issue. The next two, anglophones and francophones, are actually concepts that you can find in both the first related issue and the fourth related issue. Nationalism is obviously a term that goes back to the first related issue. Here are the second set of five concepts that you will have to define and then provide a visual cue that illustrates the meaning of, the, of these concepts. So let's look at national identity. National identity is an important concept. It's an idea found in the first related issue, but it's also found in the fourth related issue. And national identity needs to be defined. Once you've defined it and all of the other concepts and or terms that are listed, you will then begin to watch the film and provide visual cues with the explanations that illustrate the meaning of the terms and or concepts. Here's the last set of six. These mainly can be found in the fourth related issue, but certainly the definitions of all of the terms and or concepts can be found in the glossaries of the first and fourth related issues and all of them, all of their definitions can be found in the glossary section of your textbook. And again, for each of these, like the first 10, you will need to, f to define them all. And once all of the definitions have been found and included, you will then need, as you watch the film, to provide visual cues along with explanations for these specific concepts. Again, the film illustration must be done in such a way as to provide a visual cue that visually illustrates the meaning 
of the concept and or term and an explanation of exactly how the visual cue provides a visual illustration of the meaning of the concept and or term. Let's take a moment and provide you with an example. So let's look at the first set of concepts and terms. Now again, the first five mainly go back to the first related issue. Let's look at the first one, identity, and see if we can come up with an understanding of its meaning. Well, if you recall, identity is basically those key characteristics that people use to, who, to describe who they are. In other words, those key features that make each individual unique. Well, how would you use the film The Rocket to visually illustrate the meaning of this concept? Well, if you use the main character in the film, The Rocket himself, you will find that he has key characteristics that make him unique. For example, he is male. He is Quebecois and he speaks French. He plays and likes hockey. And initially, part of his occupation, his part-time occupation, was that of a sheet metal worker. But he became a member of the Montreal Canadiens and in fact he became their greatest player. And he had the nickname The Rocket. Each of these key characteristics are elements that are important in shaping the rocket's identity. What you will then need to do is for all of the rest of the concepts and terms is to define them and then once all of them are defined provide as you watch the film visual cues that visually illustrate the meaning of the concept and remember that as you provide these visual cues you need to explain exactly how they visually illustrate the meaning of the concept. Now that you know how to go about completing the exercise, why don't you have at it? Good luck.